Hello, welcome to Feritech channel. Now we are about to see one of the main concepts of cellular mobile communications. That is limitations of conventional mobile systems. Here in this video, we are going to have a very brief discussion and in a clear picture, what are the limitations that have been faced in the conventional mobile systems and how to overcome in the modern systems in a very precise manner. Let us go into the video in deep now. Now we are going to discuss the limitations of conventional mobile systems. The very first limitation is inefficient spectrum utilization. Now this spectrum utilization measurement is defined as the maximum number of subscribers that could be served per channel in the busy hour the simple formula is given by capital n that is number of subscribers divided by number of channels the typical values for n in conventional mobile systems is limited to a number a range between 37 to 53. Now it is said that in this system each channel can serve only one customer at a time in the whole area means in that particular cell site. In this case if 53 customers are associated per channel then blocking probability is typically 50 percent during busy hour. Now if you take this busy hour as a consideration then this particular parameter or sentence what we have just said now leads to a very poor service performance of the particular conventional mobile system now it can be called it, it can be said as it is not utilizing the spectrum efficiently now to achieve this the each channel should be able to serve multiple subscribers simultaneously such that large number of customers can be accommodated in frequency slot allotted for the service area now this is a, a typical limitation which is very difficult to overcome that's why we move towards modern communication systems now the second limitation poor service performance now in the conventional mobile systems the frequency reuse techniques are not available means they are not utilized hence it leads to the large number of customers allotted per channel a into it a, a very large values which creates a large blocking probability during the busy hour and large number of cars did not mature during the busy hour this leading to the poor service performance means it deteriorates the service performance now this limited bandwidth allocation lead to poor service performance means the here the issue is with the limited bandwidth allocation it can lead to poor service performance now the last limitation is limited service capability in this system just like in the previous topic there is no frequency reuse concept available here once again, there is no provision for handoff. Now, whenever a mobile unit, that is a mobile user, moves from one geographical zone to other, means one cell site to the another cell site, his call will be suddenly dropped and the user has to initiate the call again. This, is, this can be called as limited service. 
this limitation of service capability will be overcome by using the handoff mechanism which can be which can be easily available in the modern cellular mobile telephone systems now these three are considered as limitations of conventional mobile systems the very first one inefficient spectrum utilization and the second one poor service performance here the frequency reuse plays the major role because it is not available in this conventional mobile systems now coming to the last limitation the limited service capability then the key word here it is handoff because of not availability of handoff this particular user whenever travels from one cell site to the another cell site it drops the call and the user has to initiate the call once again and this leads to the limited service capability now as we have discussed in this video in a clear and brief manner about the limitations of conventional mobile systems in this playlist of conventional systems we are going to add few more videos such as like related to wireless communications optical fiber communications as well as microwave communications and slowly we are trying to add as many as possible videos which are more nearer to practical ideas such that many one can easily understand what is happening and how they have to learn the so called technical concepts for that purpose i request you to kindly share your views in our comment section and if you have to give any suggestions please provide us some feedbacks and also kindly like share and subscribe our channel for the benefit of everyone thank you very much